everyone, welcome back to another mukbang vlog. I am actually heading out to get some donuts. So I am making dinner right now, or like I kind of stopped obviously. But I am making dinner and I don't have any desserts at home. Well, at least the desserts that I want today. I am gonna get half a dozen because I feel like if I get a whole dozen, I'm going to just finish all of them. So I, I'd rather finish a half dozen than a whole dozen, right? I am very uh, prepared for my dinner today. I'm making this uh, gomak bibimbap. Gomak bibimbap is a blood clam uh, bibimbap or like mixed rice. Um, so I'm pretty excited for that. Uh, half of my ingredients are ready to go. Uh, I just have to do like some finished touches and then I get to enjoy some milk and some Dunkin Donuts. Hi, can I get a can I get a box of dozen donuts? A half dozen donuts? Hey guys, I am home and it's time to make some food. I do have to first boil the blood clams. I think when they're frozen, it is pre-cooked. I think, I'm not 100% sure, but I still boil them one more time. They are a little stronger than some other clams, so I'm just going to add a little bit of garlic. some green onions and chives. These are gonna just work as the dress, like the main sauce for the mixed rice. It's a little dry right now. I'm going to add a little bit of the broth from the clam. Okay, so I added main stuff and from here and out, I think you could just kind of like modify to your own preference. My peppers are all kind of going bad. I'm gonna try to use most of it. These are Korean peppers and they're not hot at all. <gasps> okay. Some sesame oil. Oh, this looks... Mmm! Last but not least, I have my sesame seeds. So the main ingredient or the recipe for the sauce is from a book, you know, um, a few videos ago. I don't know. I'm sure I mentioned it on my channel or my vlog channel sometime. But um, I do really like to read the Korean like, side dish or the cooking books. So this recipe is mainly from the book, but I did modify it to my own preference and to my tasting. This is what it looks like. I think I boiled a little too long, but um, I'd rather have it a little overcooked than undercooked. Let's just pick them out and put it in the sauce. I'm just like kind of marinating the clams, but it's also working as, you know, like I said, ma main sauce. I'm very excited. My hands are like shaking and like working really fast because I'm getting very hungry. <laughs> but I still have a few more ingredients to prepare uh, because I do want to make it very nutritional nutritional here is the main sauce oh my god it looks so good i don't have to taste i already kind of know how it will taste like so. okay 
So this is almost done. We have some rice. Let's add some bean sprouts that I made earlier. I want lots of it. God, it's gonna be a bomb ass dinner. It's gonna be so hearty. I'm so excited. And then we're gonna add our carrots. Uh, and then our mushrooms. I just add all of it. I thought I cut up a lot, but I feel like always with mushrooms they shrink. And then we're going to add our clams. The middle like that. It's gonna be our main sauce. I'm going to start with little, just in case like it's too salty or just too strong. So far so good. We're almost done. I'm gonna add my egg. Usually when people make this mixed rice with the clam, they don't add the egg, but um, whatever. Lastly, just gonna top it off with more sesame oil. <laughs> Voila, this is done. I'm so excited. OMG, I am so ready to eat. Ah, it looks so good. I have no energy to even mix this. So I have the leftover seasoning here. Uh, for the from the looks of it, I think I could add a little bit more. Tolan doesn't like these clams. Um, I made it for him before, but he always leaves it out, so I'm guessing he doesn't like it. So it's okay if I finish the whole thing. My eggs are gonna just stay on the side. I think I'm gonna just eat it separately. This was worth it. It took a while, but uh, some of the side dishes could last a little longer. It's very versatile. I could use it for anything else. So it was worth it. It was worth all this cooking today. Oh, delicious. My gosh, I am salivating. Been waiting for this moment. Mmm. Mmm, -hmm. You know, I think I could add more. Just the rest of it. It's really not that strong. I love that it's not overpowering because now I could pair it with my cucumber kimchi. I feel like this is such a simple looking dish because you mix everything in one bowl but it takes so many things to make this. I think I'm gonna pass out after this. Oh my god this is so good and here I am. I was about to get some McDonald's which I think I will tomorrow because I still want a hamburger. But I'm very glad I made this nutritious. Nutritious. What was I saying before? Nutritional, nutritional, nu it's been very hot today, but it's very dry heat, so I love it. It feels so good. I'm probably going to finish this and then clean up a little, rest a little, and then I'm going to enjoy my donuts. I want to watch like a good show, maybe like an anime or something. I want to be able to relax knowing that I don't have other cleaning or other stuff to do the rest of the night. I just want to sit down with my donuts, six donuts, sit down, just really kind of like take the rest of the night off after that. 
because I've been doing a lot of laundry, a lot of cleaning today. I wonder if, if this is how it's going to be for the rest of my life. Just clean, clean, clean. Cook, cook, cook. It's fine right now because I'm enjoying it. I'm nesting, getting ready for this baby, getting ready to be a mom, you know, taking care of my family. But maybe that's why there's this, that two, two, two rule. I think that rule is for you and your husband. I think every two weeks go out for a dinner or like a date night. Uh, every two months go do like a staycation or some kind of small vacation. And every two years go out of the country. I think that's like a two, two, two rule. I don't know, do people actually like try to like stick to that? I mean, I guess you don't have to follow it, but like the idea is there, like spark it up basically, right? Um, I don't know about out of country or even out of state every two months. That might be too much for uh, me and Tong. Especially, you know, I told you guys, I don't want to leave Ame. Unless you could take Ame like on a road trip. That's a different story. But I don't want to leave Ame at home like every two months, you know, alone without me. Or like being taken care of by other people. But like having a date night every two weeks doesn't sound bad at all like it's so doable honestly it doesn't even have to be Tong who's planning it it could be me um doesn't have to be the husband that always comes up with these ideas you know it could be the wife i think that's better because you actually could do something that you want to do and the husband just kind of follows finished my last walk with Ame. All the dishes are clean. Uh, I vacuumed many, many times. Uh, laundry is done. Ooh, time to relax uh, and just like wind down. I was kind of hoping that it would be a little darker or a little bit later because I mean, I love my projector. The biggest downside is if it's bright, I can't watch it because I don't know if you guys could see, but it's very, very, very light. I have my dozen donuts, uh, or half dozen donuts. Well, I should maybe I should just got a dozen because I keep saying that. I already ate two as I was cleaning and doing dishes. I I just got like a little hungry and I was like kind of dying for sweets. So, so I ate Boston cream and glazed donut. I have another Boston cream, so that is all right. And I have, this is a vanilla frosting, double chocolate, and a French cooler. They have been sitting in my fridge, so they're really cool. They're not dry. I think by tomorrow morning it might be dry if I don't put in a Ziploc bag or whatever. That is if I don't finish all of them. Because I already had two, right? So. so I have my milk. Hmm. Okay, which one do I want? Do I want another Boston cream? Yes. The seeds are kind of cold right now, and I think Boston cream is ready to go. Hmm. I've had Boston cream from pretty like gourmet or like really popular donut places. I don't know what it is. I've said this. On, I, I'm sure I said this already, but. Dunkin' Donut Boston Cream is hands down my favorite. Not gonna lie, it used to be better. I think it changed a little, something changed. Maybe they're not putting enough filling. I'm just watching one of my all-time favorite show, Tasty Guys. Not Tasty, Tasty Guys. milk is better or like black coffee is better not latte because both of them are sweet i really am being a couch potato right now but this is so amazing 